Hi, this is Connie, and welcome to my Monday. It, this was just the shortest weekend ever. It, I had to work on Saturday, so that broke up that day. And yesterday I went out to lunch with my mom, which was very nice. And the rest of the day I came home and just crashed. I, I had to fight to keep myself awake, of course, because last night I wouldn't have been able to sleep. And I did sleep pretty good. I woke up a few times, but I did sleep pretty good. Buddy left me alone. <laughs> so anyway, let's get into my makeup this week. It seems like some of you like my longer videos, which I appreciate that. Thank you so much. It means that, that you like to hear my stories, which aren't much, you know. But um, anyway, uh, yesterday we went to... I always have the same thing, always, when we go to this corner, or this place. It's called Fanny Horners, and it's the one, it's a family restaurant. It's kind of like, um, uh, oh, kind of like a Perkins, or kind of like um, Happy Chef. No, yeah, Happy Chef, is that what it's called? I can't remember anymore. But anyway, it it's a family restaurant where they, they serve breakfast 24 hours a day. You can have whatever you want 24 hours a day, from steak to breakfast to, you know, a burger, whatever. So I have the same thing all the time. I have a hot hamburger, which I absolutely love hot hamburgers. And all it is, I have them put it on a bun, just like a regular hamburger. Slice onion on there, of course. Um, uh, to me, a burger is not a burger without onion on it. So... I have to have a slice of onion on it, um, cut it in half, put gravy on it, a uh, scoop of mashed potatoes with gravy. Perfect meal. Perfect meal. That is my favorite. My mom always has a half of one and I have a full one. Um, so anyway, let's get into my makeup this week. I am wearing today, I am wearing the Jordana Fabulous... Shape and Set Gel in dark brown. Um, I don't think it's that natu actually that dark. I think it's a good color for me. But it is, this is far from my favorite. Um, I will continue using it until it dries up, whatever. But um, it's clumpy. So it takes a little bit of work to do it. But it it's still pretty once it's you know, all is said and done, it's still pretty. So, um, for my regular mascara, I'm using my Tardist, um, I don't know what color this is, Lash Paint it's called, mascara. Nope, doesn't have a name. This is what it looks like, it's just a sample size. I have a problem with this. Now, I don't mind the formula itself. The formula is fine. It makes my lashes look great. It is the where you just pop this out. See, it's very clumpy on the end there, if you can see that. So you have to wipe that off. And look at, look at the, um, can you see that? That's what I have to deal with. And the bristles are so sharp that they they hurt when you put them, you get them too close to your lashes. But when you close it up, uh, let's see, I don't know if you could be able to see that. Put it up against my skin so you can see it a little better. Can you see that? The clumps? You have to wipe it off every time? The next thing I use, I am going to start using my blushes again. Um, we're going to try this and see how it works. If it doesn't work out, then I'll, I'll quit using them. But I I just feel so bad not using them. <laughs> I, this today I'm using my MAC. Um, it's in dusk, I believe. At dusk. There you go. Such a pretty color. See, I don't even know if you can see it. I'll be able to tell when I look at the regular. 
And I am very sorry about last week's lighting. It was horrible. I'm hoping this is better. It looks good in the viewfinder. It really does. But today I have some lights over here, and I have my light right ahead of me, my daylight bulb right ahead of me. And usually that's enough, but last week just d seemed dim to me. And I, I film at 5.30 and 6 in the morning, so it's dark out. So it doesn't do me any good to have my window open. So I've got one light bulb going over here with the daylight bulb and then this one with the daylight bulb. And we're going to see if it works. I don't have a light for over here. I don't have another lamp that I could put over on this side. It would help if I did, but I don't. So anyway, back to it. I am wearing my uh, Ulta in Nude, my lip liner. And today for my lipstick, I'm wearing the e.l.f. Um, Touch of Berry. And what I'm doing is I'm just, I've got, I've got my lipsticks separated. I've got liquid lipsticks, I've got high-end lipsticks, I've got mini lipsticks, and then I've got my regular lips, lipsticks on this side. Sorry. And I have just been putting my hand in and picking out five. And then when I'm done with them for the week, I've got a piece of paper in there and I'm separating the ones that I've used to the ones that I have not used. And we'll go from there. That way I'm going to use every single one of my lipsticks. And I'm about almost half done with that, with my regular lipsticks. And that is after wearing them um, during the, the camps and all that kind of stuff too. So. Alright, that's my lipstick for the day. I don't have anything to review from from um, last week, you guys know that on Saturday I wore my, my favorites of the week, and nothing to declutter today, so that's a good thing. So I will talk to you guys in the morning. Have a good Monday. Bye-bye. Good morning, and welcome to Tuesday in my Making It Work series, and guess who got talked into working Saturday again? I really want a weekend off, and... I found out that we may be working on Labor Day. Come on. Seriously? We just started and I already need a day off. <laughs> but nobody else wants to work Saturday, so guess what? It comes down to me. But, you know, as much as I hate doing it, it's still extra money. And it's overtime. So... You know, I can't complain too much, right? Right? I can complain, but still spend that money, right? <laughs> Maybe I'll be able to buy something for 21 Days of Beauty. I don't even know what's on sale yet. Um, I don't get paid until the 7th, so, and I know it starts the beginning of the month. So I'll miss probably a whole week of it, but oh well. Anyway, here's what I'm wearing today. For my brow mascara, I'm using my favorite brow mascara. It's the Ulta Brow Tint in Blonde. And I really, really like this color. Um, this is more of the brown that I like. <laughs> and it's blonde. But it's got an itty bitty tiny spoolie, which I really like. I wish I would have saved my last one. This is my second one. I wish I would have saved my last one because I have a brow or a regular mascara in brown that I want to try, but the spoolie is way too big. So I wish I would have saved this. Okay, for my regular mascara, I am using the Maybelline Rocket today. And this has been one of my favorites drugstore mascaras for years. I have rebought, repurchased this probably three to four times maybe I just I really like it 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 stays on it makes my lashes look fine it um, this is not too awful old this one okay my next thing is my Catrice illuminating blush in La Vienne Rose I don't know if I said that right French and I just don't pronunciation just don't get along very well 
but it's absolutely gorgeous. And really nice blush for being so reasonably priced. Okay, for my lip liner today, I am wearing the Ulta Beauty Lip Liner in Pink Nude. And it's pretty much that color. And the reason I wore that is it's just about an exact match for the Milani Pink Punch. Fruit Punch, sorry. And this is what that looks like. Just so pretty together, those two colors. All right, that is my makeup for the day. Yesterday's makeup. Excuse me. Itchy. Um, I wore the MAC blush, which you know I absolutely love. Um, this L formula the, in this um, container is my favorite. I absolutely love these. Touch of. This is Touch of Berry, the one I wore yesterday. I really like it. Um, the Jordana, um, definitely not my favorite, the brow product, but it is okay. And anybody that's been watching me for a while knows that I hate this packaging on the TARDIS mascara. I hate it. On this, I don't know if the full size is any different from this one. But it is the messiest, dirtiest, most unsanitary product I've ever owned, I think. Um, I do like the way it looks on my lashes. I like the formula, but I hate the packaging. So I'm really looking forward to getting rid of this. Okay, so that was my makeup of the day yesterday, and I wore my nude lip liner. So... Um, I don't have much else to tell you except for I'm working on Saturday again, so this will be another longer video. Um, it'll be a six day instead of a five. And yesterday was, I said last week was the week from hell. Yesterday we had um, 300 and, I'm sorry, I have an itchy nose, 360 students at lunch, and they all came about the right, the same time. So, as you can tell, it was chaos for the cooks keeping up with um, the pans of food and for me keeping up with the dishes. Um, I had two full sinks of dishes that I hadn't even touched yesterday when I left. And I had a whole kitchen full of dishes that I had finished I mean, I work like a fiend all day, and um, somebody asked me the other day, well, did they dock your pay since you're just a dishwasher? I would have never been so insulted in my life, because I work harder or hard as hard as anybody in that place. To look down on me, shame on you. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Good morning and welcome to Hump Day. Um, I'm happy when my week is half over. <laughs> and it's really not going to be half over because I have to work Saturday. But um, I don't really count that. Um, so I don't know. Yesterday was super... Su every day is going to be super, super busy, I have a feeling. But... Um, it really makes my day go fast. My day, to, you know, it seems like it goes pretty darn fast. Um, you know, because I'm just so busy all day long. And then she has me, in the mornings, she'll say, Oh, can you cut some watermelon? Can you do this? Can you do that? I don't have time to do that. But I did it yesterday, and I was caught up when I left work. And that is such a good feeling to be totally caught up, have no dishes to wash when I leave. And that's a big accomplishment because we had a lot of students yesterday. <laughs> so anyway, let me get into my makeup for the day. Um, today I'm wearing the Kardashian Beauty Brow product in... Um, let's see if it says... i got to remember to start looking at this. I don't think it says. This is what it looks like. 
probably my one of my least favorite. Um, very, very wet. It's way too wet for brows. You shouldn't have a really wet product going on your eyebrows. Um, it... I don't know. How do they look in the viewfinder or in the camera? I can't really tell. I, I'm not liking the way they look at all. Um, I'm going to keep it. I'm going to give it a few more tries. If I don't like it after a couple more times, out it goes. Okay, for my lashes today, I'm using the Super Curler 24 by Rimmel. And it has got a curved wand and it's pretty good um i didn't i don't mind this at all lip liner i wore my pink uh pink nude from yesterday okay so um that was my lip liner my lipstick today is a makeup revolution in show chauffeur it's a um, rose gold bullet and the reason i used my pink nude today because this is very light very, very light, and I don't really care for that pale of a nude lipstick. Um, so I wanted it a little bit more color, and this just muted down the pink is what it did. So let's talk about what I wore yesterday. I wore the um, Fruit Punch in, from Milani. I liked it. The Rocket is still awesome. It's still rocking it. <laughs> it was even hard to get off last night when I took my makeup off. Or when I washed my face. Still my favorite brow product. The Ulta. Um, I think that's it. Oh, and my blush. Very nice blush. Um, didn't stay all day because I was sweating, but it was still a very nice blush. I forgot to tell you what blush I'm using today, by the way. I'm using Glow All The Way by Hard Candy, and this is in um, Sunburst. So pretty. This is a beautiful blush. I always want to open the wrong end. Isn't that gorgeous? You could actually just use this side alone for a highlighter if you wanted to. Beautiful. I don't, whoops, I don't know if it's showing up much at all. They brought my, my um, tile or my planks um, for my kitchen flooring last night. So they will be putting that in. I don't know when he's coming. I have no idea. Also, I bought a brand new battery for my phone. Um, I don't remember if I told you or not. I may have told you a hundred times. I don't know. But my my phone has been acting up ever since before school let out in the spring. Um, it w all of a sudden would just lose power. It You could take it off of the charger and you could almost watch the the power go down. That's how fast it lost power. Um, my battery, I should, should have brought it and showed you, was, um, puffed up. So it was a very bad battery. So I finally ordered another one. Yesterday, it was 100% at 7 when I left home. By 10.30, it was almost dead. So it lasted me about three and a half hours. Well, about four hours, I'd say. Um, which is not good. But they told me today to shut off, I mean, shut down, you know, all my open windows. So I'm going to do that, and I'm going to take it again and see how long it lasts me today. See if it'll last me at least until lunch. Because it took forever for it to charge last night when I got home. It, it wasn't even 100% when I went to bed at 10 o'clock. So... I don't know whether I bought it off of Amazon, um, bought it from a third-party seller, which had a, a, a good rating, and the reviews were good on it, so I don't know. But 
you have to give them a good review within seven days or else they won't give you a good warranty. So anyway, um, that's the one thing I don't like about it. I mean, if you don't give them a good review, you don't get the good warranty. You don't get a year's warranty. You get like, what, 30 days or something. I don't know. Anyway, this is going to be too long. So I'm going to talk to you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Good morning and welcome to Thursday morning. Um, I slept pretty darn good. I didn't go to bed until about 11 o'clock, though. So it was late for me. Um, I was watching America's um, America's Got Talent. I love that show. And got carried away a little bit. Since I don't have internet, I tape all this stuff. I mean, um, I, I get it from other sources and then I watch it. So um, I'm always late. I, I can never watch anything live or anything. So <laughs> anyway, I found out yesterday that I have Monday off, which is awesome. I um, Up until yesterday, we didn't know. We knew that we were open. And there was some people that had to work last year. Um, I wasn't there yet, so I didn't work it. But um, a couple of full-time people had to work last year along with students because they have to be open because there's still students on campus even though there's no classes. So um, she came to me yesterday and she says, you want Monday off, right? And I said, well, can I? And she said, of course. So I have Monday off. So that is going to be so nice to have two full days off. Um, I'll actually have like two and a half because I have to work four hours or three and a half or four hours on Saturday, which is not a big deal. But um, I am out of clothes, so I need to wash clothes and stuff, and and I gotta have one day to, to wind down. Just relax my back, and, and my house is such a mess, such a mess. I need to do so much. I need to sweep and mop and well, not really mop, because I'm going to get my new floors this week. And I need to vacuum, and I need to do dishes, and I, oh, you name it, I need to do it. <laughs> Clean my bathroom, stuff like that, that I've been putting off because I'm so dang tired. So anyway, here's my makeup for today. First thing I wore was my Catrice um, Cosmetics Eyebrow Filler in... I have no idea. I always forget to look. Sorry. I don't know what it is. I'm as sick of it as I'm sure you guys are too. Anyway, it's a Catrice eyebrow filler. Um, I don't mind this. But it takes a lot of work, a lot of building to get the color that you see. Because it just doesn't have a lot of color payoff. Um, but I'm going to still use it because I do like the end result, but you really have to layer it. For my um, eyelashes today, I use the Revlon Bold Lacquer uh, in... Black is black. Everybody got this in, in like Target boxes or something um, la like last summer. And I haven't had mine open too long. But I like it. Um, not that you guys can probably even notice on camera, but I like the way my eyelashes look with this. I don't have a whole lot of eyelashes to look at. So, um... I don't know how much you guys can even really tell. I wore, for my blush, I wore the Milani uh, Berry Rays in Color Harmony. Aren't they pretty? So many different shades, but I just swirl my brush through all of them. 
my Ulta nude lip liner. And I'm wearing my, um, their real big sexy lips in, by benefit, in Lusty Rose. This is in my Project Pam. Which I think I'll probably just drop out of because um, I'm not being fair to the other girls. I have not posted a video in my Project Pan for months. So um, I think I'm probably just done with it. Um, it was supposed to go till till November. Or maybe I'll, I'll keep going. But I don't have a couple of the products. They got lost in the move. Um, I haven't used some of the products in months. Um, there's a few things that I've used, like the blush and, and this and the lipsticks, but that's about it. Okay, so everything there is pretty good. I have been pretty happy with my makeup so far all week. Yesterday's makeup was um, The Chauffeur by Makeup Revolution, which I think I, will, I am going to declutter. Just because it is so, it's such a light lipstick and I don't wear it that often. Um, I really like the Super Curler Mascara by Rimmel. Or, I can't say I love it, but I like it. Um, and for my brows yesterday, the Kardashian Beauty, I, I am just not a fan of their brand. I just... The only thing that I found that I really like in their brand is the, the one blush that I have. And other than that, I am just not a fan. I don't know. Um, anyway, it I slept pretty good. I did tell you that I, I was still awake till 11, but I woke up at, it was 5.18 and had to pee really bad. <laughs> Because I didn't go before I went to bed last night, so I had to really pee and was disappointed to find out that I only had 10 minutes before the alarm went off. <laughs> and then I hit the alarm three times just to relax before I had to get up, just to get myself ready to get up. Anyway, I will see you tomorrow. Have a great day. Good morning Bye. and welcome to Friday. And it's the last day of most people's work week, maybe. Hopefully a lot of you have a three-day weekend coming up. I have to work um, three and a half hours or four hours tomorrow. Um, could even be three. Who knows? Uh, last week, last Saturday when I worked, I worked three. So it could be this way. This time we have actually have one extra person working tomorrow so and they're all people that I know will show up um, they're not flaky students <laughs> and um, I don't think there's anything else to talk about uh, I will talk to you tomorrow I, of course I'll do my last I'll do my favorites of the week tomorrow and do you want me to do that on Fridays do you want me to do like my, my favorites of the week or do you want me to do five things a week? Let me know that. Uh, do you want me to do like four sets of face makeup a week, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and then Friday do my favorites out of those four? Or do you want me to just keep doing five things every week? Let me know in the comments below, please. Um, I'll go right into my makeup. Um, first of all, I wore my Too Faced Brow Quickie in Universal Taupe. Um, very dry formula. It took me a bit to get it where I wanted it. But um, it's pretty good. I don't mind it. Um, I've been sneezing, so I tell you. And for my mascara today, I used the Rimmel Lash Accelerator uh, Mascara with Avec Grow Lash Complex. And it's got a very long wand, which I really like. Uh, 
it's a very wet formula. It's still very wet after using it quite a few times. It is um, a little clumpy because it's wet. So you have to work with it a little bit, but I really do like the way it look, makes my lashes look. But I have this problem with with um, getting so much mascara on my lid because I don't know whether I have fat lids or what. You know, fat everywhere else, why not my lids, I guess. Uh, but I get it on my lids so bad. And um, with this mascara, you have to be careful, you know, if, you, if you're blinking a lot or whatever because it will transfer while it's wet. Okay, for my blush today, I'm using the Milani in T Rose, the Rose Blush. And um, I'm stepping down from my project pan. So the, I was going to use this every week, but I'm, I'm not going to now. I'll just put it back into my collection. Isn't that gorgeous? My favorite blush right there. Um, I used my Ulta lip liner in Nude again. And I used one of my favorite lip, nude lipsticks. This is uh, 620 Julianne's Nude by L'Oreal. And this is the color. It is beautiful. I love this shade. You know, it's kind of a pinky nude, which I, I like. That's my favorite. So that is today's makeup. Yesterday. Let's see, where did I go? My um, brow product was the Catrice Eyebrow Filler. Not my favorite by far. This um, took me a long time to get it to work correctly. But it stayed on my, my, la on my brows. So anything that stays, you know, even if I have to work a little bit, I'm keeping. <laughs> Um, for my lipstick, I wore the um, They're Real by Benefit uh, Big Sexy Lips in Lusty, Lusty Rose. Yep. And this was in my project pan, too. You can see I've used quite a bit of it, actually. This is how much is left. And I really like it. Um, a lot of people don't like it. But once you get used to how you're supposed to use it, I don't mind it at all. M mainly it just, it, it doesn't really, at first, when you first use it, it looks like you've got lip liner on. But after you start, you know, just putting lipstick on more, it just kind of goes together. So I really like it. And this is my favorite color out of the four that I got in the kit. Um, my mascara was the Bold Lacquer by Revlon. I like this mascara. It's a good mascara. I don't have a lot of problems with mascaras unless they, they the bristles hurt my lids or they're super dry where it just does not do anything. Or they're so wet that all they want to do is clump and you cannot get the clumps out. Um, Otherwise, I don't have a whole lot of problems with mascara. You know, as long as they work and they they look like they like my I have lashes. You know, it looks like my lashes look better. Then I'm happy. Um, what did I wear? I wore the Milani um, Berry Rays Color Harmony is the name of it, and Berry Rays is the color. Hope you can get a good picture of this because it is just so pretty. You know, and no blush is going to stay on me all day. No. Um, first of all, blushes don't show up very well on me on my bare skin. Um, you know, I use moisturizer every single day and I put my serum in with my moisturizer and then put it on my face because it's just easier for me that way. I've done it that way for since I started using serums and it works um, so I have that on my my face and then I put my makeup on so I'll see you tomorrow and I hope you guys have a wonderful weekend
Hi Bye -bye. guys and welcome to Saturday and I only have to work a few hours today. I thought I'd have all this time today to do, you know, I sorted my laundry last night. I have piles of laundry to do um, because I have still haven't got it all done from when I moved in. I just have been going over to my mom's and stuff so I've only done a load or two here and there. So I have piles of laundry to do and I thought for sure that I'd get it all um, packaged up and, and out to the car. I don't have time. So I'll have to, if I decide to do it, do my laundry tonight, which I don't know. It depends on how I feel when I get off and how busy the laundromat is. So um, I might go tonight and do it. I don't know yet. But anyway, I went to bed about midnight last night, some somewhere around midnight, and woke up at 6 a.m. and thought, oh crap, here we go, you know, um, won't be able to go back to sleep. So about, so I ate breakfast about 10 o'clock, had a couple eggs and toast and some sausage, and uh, laid down in my chair about 11-ish, I think, and woke up at 12.30, I thought, okay, that's fine. You know, I rolled over and, and was thinking about some things. And all of a sudden, I opened my eyes and it was 2.30. <laughs> so I slept the whole, the, my day away with not getting anything done. But at least I have two more days off. So, uh, and as you can see, I hope my eyes, that I am wearing a little bit more makeup today. Not a lot. Um, I just added a few things because um, I'm out in front today, out in the dining area, do, you know, getting that ready, doing all that, wiping down tables after the kids leave, stuff like that. I'm not in the dining room or dishwasher today. So um, I don't have to wear a hairnet or anything like that, and I'm not going to sweat as bad, so I thought, well, I'll wear some makeup today. Anyway, um, I'm wearing some of my some of my favorites, not exactly my very favorites, but some of my favorites of the week today. And one of those is my favorite Ulta eyebrow in, uh, in blonde. Light, sorry, in light. It's got this little itty bitty spoolie on it that I absolutely love because you can just go where you want with that. Okay, and then for my eyes today, I just grabbed what was closest to me. Or my, They're right beside me here, but I grabbed my chocolate bar. Um, kind of saying goodbye to my project pan. <laughs> um, I, and I did not wear any eye primer. I'm just working three and a half to four hours. So I wore this as my base. This is my transition. And I wore this one on my lid. So this will be the last time I, I use this palette for a while, so I thought that I would go ahead and use it. Um, for my mascara, I'm wearing, revisiting uh, my Revlon Bold Lacquer by Grows Luscious uh, in, what did I say this was? Blackest Black. And I really like it because it, it's got a pretty long wand. And the spoolie is nice. The, the, the kind of spoolie I really like. And they make my lashes look pretty good. Alright. So next is my... Um, this is not my favorite. You know my favorite is the Milani. But I decided I would use my second favorite for the week. And that is the Hard Candy. Uh, glow All the Way in Sunburst. And I just think this is so pretty. I should have used the highlighter on this, too. But I, I mainly just kind of used my brush over in the pink today. I don't know if you can even see it on my bare skin. And then I used the Cindy Luminizer for my highlighter. Which broke not very long ago. I believe in the move. Which really... Uh, I've got a couple of backups of not uh, not the full size, but I've got uh, a couple of smaller backups of this. And then for my lipstick, I did not wear lip liner, which I'll probably regret. But I wore the um, 
L'Oreal Julianne's Nude. This is my favorite of the week. I, th I just think this nude is so pretty. Thanks, guys, for sticking with me. Thanks to those of you that comment. Um, there could be a lot more of you that comment something or give me likes. I'll talk, you know, just to show me that you're, you're enjoying my content. I will talk to you on Tuesday. Bye-bye. Have a great Labor Day.